Hey guys, it's Natalie. Welcome back to my channel, Living the Oil Life. It is Let's Talk Thursday, and I am actually in Maryland. I had to drive up here, and so I thought what a perfect time to talk about oils that help you on a 15-hour road trip, especially when you're by yourself. So I've got my little compact case of oils. Um, that I actually got free from Young Living because uh, they had messed up one of my orders and sent this by mistake. So I have this filled with goodies. And then I also have this one that um, is a portable case. And this is filled with goodies also. Sorry, I don't know if you can see it. Um, but this is the one that um, I usually carry with me um, on a daily basis. So this has kind of the oils that I have. But I just wanted to share a couple that are perfect for a 15-hour road trip. So, of course, no road trip would be complete without a thieves a spray. I take this wherever I go, uh, especially out in public. They're perfect for gas stations, uh, restaurants, things like that. Spray things down. Uh, keep those germs at bay. Uh, so I love this Thieves spray and it's great to spray in your throat if you have a little irritation in there while you're driving or trying to keep you awake probably. Um, I love the, my Thieves spray and then one of my favorite oils this trip was Energy. Energy is absolutely amazing and if you haven't tried it, make sure you do. Um, I know it has juniper and lemongrass and pe uh, black pepper and I can't remember what else is in here, but it does give you a boost of energy and it helps you with your mental clarity um, because I forgot my mental clarity. Uh, but all I did on the trip was I opened it up and I inhaled it really deeply like three or four times and then I put it on my pulse points on my wrists and down the sides of my neck and it was really, really great for this trip. Um, it really did help a lot. So if you're going on a long road trip and you are driving, you need energy. Um, and then of course, um, my lip balm. I have to have my lip balm because of the air, the heat, going from hot to cold and my lips just get, um, get chapped and ugh, I don't like it. So I have that and then I had frankincense and I would just put some of that on my forehead just to kind of keep me grounded and, and keep me um, alert and thinking. And then of course I had my Valor. Um, I put Valor on the back of my neck and on the bottom of my spine, um, kind of to help my back support a little bit. And. Um, and also the Valor for driving. Um, I don't know if you saw my Instagram or my tweet yesterday about driving in Atlanta. Uh, being in the South for 14 years, I am not used to driving by myself in uh, rush hour traffic in Atlanta and Baltimore and things like that. So Valor really helped with that. Um, and I also had my tummy jies. Uh, because I'm out of dye jies again, but I have tummy jies in case I ate something uh, that did not agree with me, but I was fine. And then I brought Awaken just in case. Um, I know it's not to keep you awake, but I thought, you know what, just in case I need it, I'm gonna bring it anyway, but I didn't, I didn't need that. And uh, what else did I have? I had White Angelica to keep those negative Nellies away on myself, from myself, and thinking bad thoughts and negative thoughts and things like that while I was driving. Um, I needed that, uh, especially because I forgot to bring um, my car diffuser with me, so I just kept smelling my oils the whole time. Uh, and then, of course, being stressed and all of that, driving for 15 hours with the traffic and just your mind just going a thousand miles a minute. Um, I knew that my stressors were going to be high, so I knew to bring um, extra Ningxia Red because I knew I was going to need that extra antioxidant support, so I made sure I brought that, and I drank one right before I left, and then I drank another one uh, probably about halfway in. Um, I drank uh, another packet of those, and yes, they're two ounces, so I was doubly good uh, yesterday. And then, of course, to go with your Ningxia, you have to have your Nitro, uh, because I don't do energy drinks or caffeine shots or anything like that, but I do my Nitro, which I absolutely love, love, love. And I only did two. Um, I did one probably about, probably about four o'clock I did one, and then I did another one about, I think it was about nine, I did another one uh, just to be safe because 15 hours is a long drive, especially at night. I got a late start, uh, so I did not actually arrive in Maryland. I pulled over for about 
probably about two hours, I guess, if that, but I couldn't sleep just because of all the traffic and everything. Um, so this really helped. So that's what I took on my 15 hour road trip. I would love to know what you guys take on yours. Comment below and let us know. I have peppermint somewhere in here, but I can't remember what I did with it, but I didn't need it. I thought I would, um, but I was fine with the energy. Um, the thieves, I did spray my throat twice. Um, and kind of just spritzed it around me just to get that cinnamon and the, the peppiness of the thieves in it. I did do that. Um, but with just my energy and the um, Ningxia and the Nitro, I was good for 15 hours. I was very surprised. So we'll be drinking more Ningxia and Nitro today because I didn't get any sleep barely. Uh, so that's it for uh, Let's Talk Thursday. I would, like I said, I would love to hear what you guys take on your road trips. Comment below and let us know if you like this video video, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can get notifications of more videos. I hope you guys have a great weekend. I'll see you Monday for Must Have Monday. Keep living the oil life, guys, and I'll see you later. Bye.